Welcome back to Main Street Living. Quincy, Tom, we know that Tom Gregory is a co-host here on Main Street Living, but we also know that he hosts Your View's popular show, Driven, but that's not all. That's not yeah. it. No, it's not it, Tom. I think you know this, okay? In addition to all of that, you're also a movie star. Do tell, man. <laughs> I don't know <laughs> if I would say movie star. I do appear in the brand new movie, Big George Foreman that is coming out April 20th. I am in that movie, but I'm not in the trailer as we can see now. Listen to me, George. You got a punch like I've never seen. But in every battle, the greatest foe that we will combat isn't here. Imagine that. You live one way your whole life. Heavenly Father, thank you for this food. George should change his name from poor man to poor man. To hurt. Down goes Frazier! What's my name now, fool? Foreman is the new heavyweight champion of the world. Where's all that rage coming from? I don't have any rage. And it becomes all you know. Let's thank God for the food, y'all. I bought the food, mama. George Foreman ain't no new champ. He is the new chump. We gonna get it on because we don't get along. Who said that? You said nothing, George. George, 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 Your heart stopped. We thought he was dead. I was. I'm done. I'm not going to box anymore. Do you know what you're walking away from, son? I want to spread the word of God and what I saw. How's being a preacher going for you? It's hard. Harder than getting punched in the face. Sometimes it feels about the same. Hey, Shelly, come on and enjoy yourself. Power Company said we never paid the bill. Really? There's only two things I know how to do. That's box and preach. And preach you won't pay the bills. You made me something once, Doc. You can do it again. It is my destiny to win the heavyweight championship belt again. Last time they saw me, I looked like Superman. So now you look like the Michelin Man. This ain't no beauty contest. Michael Moore is 26 and unstoppable. How can you beat that man? Foreman is considered an old man in this young man's game. It's now or it's never. Mr. Foreman, that funny little grill deal you signed is starting to generate some substantial checks. Really? Now I'm just surprised it shows a big old fat guy like me to sell a beer <laughs> to help people get lean. <laughs> okay, the movie, first of all, looks really cool. I love how the story, you know, it goes from boxer to priest to boxer again. And, and throughout the trailer, though, Tom, I was looking for you. And you're right, you said you weren't in it. So... What was your role? Tell us what you did. And My you role do. is I am a uh, sports anchor. Ooh. A sports anchor. I am a combination of a bunch of ESPN Sports Center guys. Mm. And that that's what I am. I'm on TV in a movie. Nice. I love it. Nice. I, do and you have lines? I have lines. You can you can hear me. I, I'm reading without a teleprompter, by the way. Oh, so, oh no. I had to memorize my lines. <laughs> you know, I'm I'm sure it wasn't difficult for you to audition for this because you already have a radio voice when you speak, man. So you cheated. Guys like me, you know, <laughs> we have to go through the audition process and get and get canned, but you No, you know, actually the director, uh George Tillman, uh during my audition said the first thing he said he goes, "You're not an actor, are you?" And I'm like, "Oh, I'm ruined." <laughs> He goes, no, I don't want an actor for this role. I want somebody who's more of a TV guy. And I go, oh. I am a TV guy. Move over, Regis. <laughs> yes. <I'm seeing> now. <laughs> yeah. 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 So what was the audition process like? That was it. I sent out, uh, I had to do an audition because of, you know, COVID. You just do it just like we're doing this show. Right. And then I got a, a call back on my very first audition. And we were filming Driven in San Diego. And I, in a hotel room. Popped up the old laptop and did a reading. And then I got a, the role about six months later because George Foreman 
the actor Chris Davis has to go from young George to older George. Plump George. And right. there's a like, plump George. Yes. And yes. there's an uh, eight week time where he's gaining, uh, going from about 220 to about 275. Oh my. Seven this is incredible. Thousand calories. No. A day. No, no, yes. no. I can't. I can't even imagine. And before we go quickly, Tom, what were the shooting days like? It was one day. And I will tell you what was crazy <laughs> for me. It was my first movie is we do a program like this with about six people. We have wonderful people behind the scenes. Yeah. I'm doing, I'm recreating a television show and I'm actually, there's 30 people on this ginormous set. And I was like, wow, it's a whole different world. Wow. Well, you know what, Tom? I'm going to fan. I'm going to be a fan. Oh, here, here's my <laughs> selfie. <laughs> I did it. I got it. Great. Put that on You're, Instagram right now. You guys are so funny. The movie comes out on April 28th, and we know you've not seen yourself in the movie yet, so we can't wait to all see it together. We're excited to watch. Tom, yeah, very cool. Congrats. Tom. Well, thank you. And now that that segment, this segment is over and my ego is giant size, let's talk about easy ways to downsize next on Main Street Living.